When Billy came to the clinic, um, we found that he had both his eyeballs out of his um, eyeball socket. Um, he had blood coming out of his mouth as well. We suspect that probably something had hit Billy on the head um, that made both of the eyeballs come out. Um, and the chin had probably hit something hard. It had a little fracture on the chin. So because of its extensive injuries, we had to go in and remove the eyeballs. He actually coped really well. Um, he adjusted to a small surrounding at first. Um, he could find his food, he could find his litter tray, and then once he settled in, we moved into a bigger boarding kennel, and he was gaining weight and eating and quite happy. Cats cope really well, especially if they're kept indoors. They know their surroundings, and they can live quite a comfortable life. We're so excited after being with us for six weeks. Billy's just found his forever home. Ah, hi Billy. Oh, he's so handsome. I was thinking about getting a pet because we're living in a unit and our, our dog died three or four years ago. And I was just missing that companionship. We had to go down and get him, which was a, a fair way. As soon as I saw him, he just, oh, it's so gorgeous. It's just, just a lovely cat. I was quite cranky when Karen came home with the cat. And I suppose it took about three or four days. And I just, she's just part of the family now. She's one to go over. We've been going to the vets over there at Burris PCA. They took out some stitches and then they had him back again and they put him under and they took out the wire from his jaw. All right. And they gave him a clean bill of health. You'd be surprised how quickly he can navigate around the flat. Yeah. Like he knows where his food is and he's never made a mistake going to the toilet. And he doesn't seem to touch anything. It's as though he's getting a, a vibe of things in there. I don't know, it's just, I can't understand it. Wow. I think he's from another planet. <laughs> we had a granddaughter here for three days and we got her stroller out. She's just over two. And for joke, I put him in the stroller. He loved it, wouldn't get out. I had to push him around the unit in it. <laughs> and he just didn't get out. He just sat in it the whole time. He's just been perfect. Please don't forget to register and join us for Cupcake Day this year.